Hey everybody, Sean here and welcome to Revealing Truth. Mike Bickle is a false teacher in the New Apostolic Reformation. He believes we can all prophesy and that it's okay to be wrong most of the time. And this goes against scripture that says prophecy is one of the gifts from God and that not everybody has the same gifts. I did a lengthy video on him three years ago that I will leave a link to at the end of this video. But yesterday, the dissenter put out an article that some serious accusations have been made against him. And apparently the accusations have been deemed credible by other elders of the church based on the corroborating testimonies of several victims, painting a picture of manipulation and intimidation. And now a public statement has been made on this as of October 28, 2023. This has been, as you can imagine, one of the most unbelievably difficult, complex weeks of our lives. Unimaginable. Never imagined we would be on this platform saying these things. As you never imagined, you'd be in those chairs hearing these things. I'll leave the link to that full video below, but the leadership team was made aware that these allegations span several decades and that this abuse is credible. They apparently went to Mike personally in the spirit of Matthew 18, but they were repeatedly rebuffed by him and refused any sort of meeting. And instead, Mike used manipulating and intimidating tactics towards the victims to isolate them and discredit them. As it continues, they were shocked at these allegations and inappropriate conduct with these women. And that's how it often is in these cases. These people are all smiley and nice when you meet them, but behind the closed doors, we learn what's really going on. But these allegations were so serious, they couldn't be ignored. They made it clear that the allegations were sexual in nature and that he used his spiritual authority over the victims to manipulate them. Now, even though Mike wasn't cooperating at first, this video was just posted hours ago. And this is where we're at now. On October 26th, the IBKC executive leadership team asked Mike Bickle and he agreed to not preach or teach from the IPKC platform. Attend our 24 hour prayer room or engage his social media channels while we work with others to assess this situation. God's truth and justice is what we need to pray for in this situation, and that God would help all of those victims as they go through this. Many preachers love to speak about reaping what you sow, especially when it comes to finances. But nobody likes to look at that teaching when we see people like Mike Bickle reaping what he's sown. Of course, we all hope that Mike will get right with God and quit misleading people like he's done for so many years. But we also pray that God would use this time to open the eyes of all those that have been deceived by people in the New Apostolic Reformation. If you haven't seen the video on IHOP and Mike, then click that link on the screen now. But until next time, take care and God bless.